Wanna make this mechanical gear animation blender? Let's do it. But first, let's learn about drivers. What are drivers? In the simplest way possible, we use drivers to animate anything on a particular axis automatically. For example, take this gear, press N to open the properties menu and type hashtag frame divided by 10 into the axis you want to animate. Blender will automatically do the work for you. You can divide or multiply the value to control the speed. If you want the motion in reverse, simply make the value negative. To rotate it faster, decrease the division value. To make it slower, increase the value just like this. Now, we will use the same method but in a slightly more advanced way to make a complete gear animation. First, let's add a gear. But to make the gear option visible in the mesh menu, go to edit preferences and in the add-ons tab, search for extra mesh and enable it. Then click on save preferences. Next, press shift A, go to mesh and under extra object, add a gear. Now select the gear model, press shift D to duplicate it and place it here. After that, press N to open the properties menu. On the Z rotation axis, right click and choose add driver. Then use the eyedropper tool to select the first gear. Next, click on show in drivers editor. Choose the Z Euler rotation and in the type drop down, choose Z rotation. Now, select the first gear, press R plus Z to rotate it on Z axis. As you can see, when we rotate the gear 1, gear 2 rotates automatically. To make it align properly, select the second gear, right click on its driver and edit it. Make the expression negative to rotate it in the reverse direction. Hit the space bar to see the animation in action. Next, select the gear 2 and duplicate it. Then edit the driver expression and make it positive for the reverse order. Adjust and place it properly in the same. Now you can populate your entire scene by duplicating and arranging the gears. And that's it you're done. Your mechanical gear animation blender is ready. Follow Art of v for more.